Hello Udemy, I am Shazad Ahmed from Shakespeare.com and uh, welcome in lecture number 7. Today we are going to discuss about the code completion. So you know very well that you have uh, libraries, a lot of libraries available you know, while working on the coding writer. For suppose the library, uh, I am saying this load library and now I am saying form validation. So form validation, why we use the form validation library to validate our forms. Now. If you are using the PHP store, that means I am saying this, sorry, this form validation and now if control the space button, as you can see it is not giving us any hint, so it is not completing the code, so this is a problem because if you are working on multiple frameworks like laravel and coding like check php and custom php that means yeah, it's hard to memorize each and every code so now this is, a, this is a problem the solution is the solution is the library how can you set that so now now go to the google find the code completion in php store in php store and now add the coding writer here ok so now as you can see the first result is github so this is a file so they are saying that PHP strong code completion to coding writer HMVC. So consider the MVC because the MVC is a design pattern. Uh, they are saying the PHP storm or PHP file into your CI project code, then PHP strong will index it. Now download this bad boy where you can download. I am saying uh, ACI at the root of the project. Okay. So now ACI open this and now as you can see it's must coding night. Now I'm saying extract this or open this bad boy. What you just need to copy one file. This is the PHP storm file. So now you have added the PHP storm file. Now they are saying that please the second step. They are saying go to the system code folders. So go to the system the system and these are the core folder and now they are saying select the controller.php and the model.php file right click and set mark as plain text so do that so this is a controller and this is a mark right click they are saying mark as plain text okay now if you are saying that this form validation and now as you can see now it's giving you the hands the all the methods which is available in the form validation library for suppose set rules so this, is, this is a set rules and it's also telling you the fields okay so this is very important and this is very useful if you are working on a large project uh, and uh, so it should really depend upon you either you are using or you are following this code because i always use this code completion in PHP store. So PHP store is a nice ID, but you have to use this before doing further. Why we are doing all of these things step by step? Because you know very well that is step by step for all the users. First of all, if you are advanced learner, that means we are saying that if someone is starting to learn the advanced things. So these things for those pupils. Okay, so now you have added the bootstrap 4 and now you have added the code completions. Now in the next lecture we are we will discuss about the how can you break your HTML view into multiple far parts and why you need to break your HTML element into multiple parts. So thank you for watching.